and wrestling fans, right here, right now, we will find out who is the new Interim Lady Luck Champion. Let's get that match underway. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the Interim Gold Rush Pro Wrestling Lady Luck Championship. So you heard it. This is for the Interim this Championship. Match has a 30 we have minute Thunder Rosa time with limit. us. Referee for this contest, and Sparky you know, this is, Balor. You know, I know it's difficult for you. You've held that championship since its inception. You defeated cheerleader Melissa. But you know tonight, you're going to have to give it over to one of these two women. How are you feeling? It sounds like you hurt your shoulder a couple of weeks ago. Yeah, I mean, I'm really, I'm extremely sad because, you know, I've been working really hard to bring the name of women's wrestling, you know, to everywhere, especially bring the um, notice about Making Gold her Rush way to the ring the from parts and unknown. I know that she's and she I is the leader of the Buru Nation. She is the Fallen Flower, right. you know, she the championship to your Japan. I defended this championship twice in Mexico and, um, and in many states in the United States. So for me to lose it the way that I had to is very unfortunate. So tonight you have two people who are in that tournament who did well, the Fallen Flower Kikio and the next woman coming out, Brittany Wonder. I know this is kind of a cliche question, but you face Kikio a lot. Who is, do you have a preference here? Do you have someone that you would like to see when you get your chance to fight for the title that you unfortunately had to relinquish. Um, I want the I want the person that is gonna become the new Lady Luck Championship to really represent what this championship means. Right. You know, we uh, we give them the value that it deserves, and I think uh, whoever wins, it has big big shoes to fill. Right. You know. Well, Brittany Wonder, who is making her and PPW her debut making her tonight, way to the ring. she's From someone the that second star to you know, the left. had a good and showing in that tournament, and she's going to have a welcome. test in the oh, Fallen Sugar. Flower PPO. Brittany but, you know, Wonder. you've had such a great run, especially here in Phoenix Pro Wrestling. You know, what does it mean? You talked about the heritage you're trying to bring to the Lady Luck Championship. What does it mean for you to come out here and wrestle in front of these fans in Petaluma? It means a lot, you know, because Petaluma is, like, it has a very special place in my heart. And I know that they have seen some of the best female wrestler in Northern California is yeah. here in Petaluma. So again, I feel extremely sad that I'm not in that ring today defending what is rightfully mine. Right. But you're gonna get your shot at one of them which is good, you know, whoever wins tonight, you're gonna get your opportunity to try and, and continue to be the champion. This is only an interim championship, and we understand that, you know, you're gonna get your opportunity when you're good and healed, and you said, you know, you have a couple of weeks left. What's the prognosis? Um, well, they said it was a, a partial tear on uh, my rotator cuff. You know, uh, my, my rehab has been really good. I've been resting a lot. I've been focusing a lot on you know, and other and other stuff. So um, I'm hoping that I'll be back by by July. What what can you tell us about Brittany Wonder? We've seen Kikio before. It's our first time seeing Brittany. What can you tell us about Brittany, who did Br so well Brittany in that Wonders, tournament? Brittany Wonder is it's a, a very tough competitor. She's been in the uh, NorCal scene for a, quite a bit already. She you know she started in Sacramento, and uh, she mainly is based on. Uh, she works for Hood Slam right now, and she she's she's a really like said, really really strong competitor. So I'm excited to see this match. So two of the people who went far in that tournament, the Lady Luck Tournament, and the winner of this match will be the interim champion. Uh, you know what, I don't, it's one thing is like, I don't trust Kikio because uh, uh, she, um, <laughs> she has very interesting tendencies to win her matches. Yeah. So we'll see. Speaking today. of interesting tendencies, that's, uh, that's both a hug and it looks like a, a bear hug by Brittany, and a uh, little standoff here. Very interesting. Yeah, very interesting start to this match. Just getting out of the way of Kikyo. Oh, another hug. Just kind of smothering her right now. This is very interesting. Oh, and now, well, oh. Oh, a headbutt. And now she comes off the ropes and 
a rolling body attack there. Oh boy, cover One. two. Oh boy. Big kick out from yeah, Kikio. Brittany kind of showing some stuff off here. Oh, good power lifting up Kikio there. Definitely. Oh, Brittany trying to figure out where Kikio is. Oh boy, Flat a complete liner. shot. Yes. Kikio. That's one of uh, that's actually one of the signature moves from um, from Brittany Wonder. You know that that flatliner is killer. Yeah, and the shoulder of Kikio, she seems like she's favoring that now after taking that shot. Oh, here comes Brittany, and she tried to dive to the outside, but Kikio is oh, playing another. possum. See, that's exactly what I told you. Right. Like, he, she cannot play clean. She, yeah, she's 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 always Very cutting evident. corners, right? Absolutely. And she's trying to cut corners there, but Brittany trying to hold her off. Oh, she tried that hip attack again, but missed. And oh, what a kick. kick in the face. My goodness. This is what you're talking about. The, the women's wrestling scene in Northern California really coming up. And, yeah, and, and you have been a, a big part of that, obviously. Yeah, like I said, I'm really proud that uh, we have, that I've been uh, a part of, of, of this change and uh, just bringing attention to uh, right. Northern California women's wrestling and women's wrestling in general, you yeah. know. And it's kind of, you know, going back to your title went over against Tierla and Melissa, that's kind of a passing of the torch moment because, of course, Tierla and Melissa, one of the greatest women's wrestlers in the history of the United States. Absolutely. And like I said, uh, being, Whoa. being Whoa. able to defeat Tierla and Melissa was one of my dreams. And um, and I hope, like, I really, really hope that whoever wins this match, like, it's able to uh, pass the torch, although this is an interim championship. Right. You know? And you're going to get the opportunity to face one of them as this spills over the rail. And we saw this in, a, in your last match here, that when you faced uh, with Samara, Kikio, and Shotzi Blackheart, this went into the crowd. It turned into a, a, a no contest, basically. Yes, yes. And this is what you were talking about with Kikio. It's like she's not afraid to kind of cut corners here and get dirty, get down and dirty. And right now, they're just fighting into the crowd, trying to get one over on each other. and. They're making the, the horseshoe here over right in front of us. Let's see who gets the best out of who. Yeah, and you know, I think Sparky, oh man, a shot there. Sparky Ballard has Brittany with the shot there to send Kikio down. Sparky's got to get these women back in the ring. Now, obviously a champion has to be crowned. It's not like they're going to have a count out here, and, and I think Sparky knows that, but getting this back to the ring is of utmost importance right now. We'll get, they'll get back on the ring. They just like really want to show who's the best of who, you know. Right, and speaking of which, Brittany's going to try and clothesline Kiki over, and she does. She close her, clothesline her over the rail Yeah. with all her force. Yeah, I mean, Brittany's really been showing something here in her PPW debut. Interim Lady Luck Championship match. The winner of this will have your belt for at least a short time, and then you're going to get a chance to face a winner and a cover there and a two count. Yeah, and it's important to mention that whoever wins this match will be able to defend it next week at the uh, Lady Lady Luck Championship. Uh, we have a, a it's Golden Envy, it's called. I'm so sorry. Right. sorry. Golden Envy at yeah. Gold Rush. Yeah. All female show again, and we have great competitors coming too, you know. So. Um, and one of these women are, are going to be at the top of the food chain in that show. Yes, they're, yes. They're gonna be like up. I said, it's like it is unfortunate when this happens, like due to injury. You know, that's like, I mean, it opens doors for other people. Right. And uh, as we can see, uh, Brittany Wonder has been doing a really good job right now and like showing what she's she's capable of in the ring. But Kikio is taking control now for the first time. And we've seen her before. You talk about taking shortcuts, and they're just going to go for the blatant choke right over the middle rope. And that's the type of stuff you have to be aware of with Kikio. She's not afraid to, to do that type of stuff. Break the rules, cut the corners, but she's dangerous. You've faced her before. What's it like being in, in the ring with Kikio? Um, we know each other very well. Very, very well. Like We've been um, you know, facing each other for quite a while now. Okay. She was actually you know, one of my first ones, and uh, we know each other very, very well. Yeah, you know, you she knows my, she knows me inside and out, and I, I know her inside and out. Yeah, so I know if we, if we face each other, you know, she will, she will get the best out of me. Like I'm not, and my people might be afraid of her, but believe me, believe me, I'm not afraid of her, and yeah. I'm not afraid of any opponent because I have faced most of them, one of them, some of the most difficult opponents all over the world, and you know what? I'm not afraid of taking her again if she wins. 
You've been an international superstar for sure. It's been just under two years that PPW has been around, but you have been one of the shining stars here. And now one of these two women have an opportunity to... She's stretching her out. Yeah. She's stretching her out, man. And that's really tough right there. That's a tough spot for Brittany to be in. Yeah. All that weight rearing back there with that rear chin lock, a camel clutch applied. And Kikyo, who's got the size advantage right now, trying to wear down Brittany, but Brittany She's is trying shown. She's to use all her weight. Oh boy, look at the strength here by Brittany. Has her on her back and she sits out, lays out, and takes the wind out of the fallen flower, Kikyo. She looks hurt. I've been really impressed with Brittany show strength in this match. She really has. I mean, she's shown some really awesome kind of hidden strength here to yeah, get Kiki like up. Yeah, she's a tough competitor. And she's she's a veteran here in, in, in Northern California, so. Yeah, she said she's been around five she works, years or so. Yeah, yeah, she works with men. She works with women. She works with everybody. You know, she's not afraid of anybody. Oh, that's a big time clothesline, man or woman. The second one. And she is getting in control, and there's a hip attack right there. Oh, she's gonna do the turn. The, the turn down for what? Oh, there it is. She's doing the turn down for what, senores and senores? She's getting ready, she's getting ready. Turn Let's but see. for what? No. Oh, no. Kikyo out of the way, and now she charges in and goes right Kiko. to the stomach. And Kikyo, with all that size, a kick to the, the side of the kick. face. Oh, that's T.O. Cover. Covers. And a two count. And so this has been back and forth here these last couple of minutes. Neither woman giving way. No, they, they don't. They really want this. You know, it's just like one of the, you know, really wonder, uh, this is actually a big shot that she was mentioning in one of her podcasts that she hasn't been given a shot to get a, a uh, championship, a uh, women's championship, and this is a great opportunity for her to do that. And Kikio you know? went to the top rope and took a risk, and that's why they call it a risk, because something like that can happen. And now she's in the tree of woe, and Brittany's going to the top rope. What does she have planned here? Uh oh. Oh, this could be dangerous. To the top! Oh, she sits out! Oh, my goodness, right if on the if back she of her head! Out, kicks out of this, I don't know what's going to take her to like. Cover? Can we have an interim champ? Oh, she oh, reached no, under she the rope. I mean, that's the, that's what I, exactly what I'm talking about. You know, she always has to do something like this. Always. Kiki will always have to cheat on everything. Taking the short way out. And Brittany thought she had it. And she's saying it's three. She doesn't think it's two. She's got to watch out, though. Kiki is up behind her. Turns her around. Kick to the stomach. Up. Oh, she's oh. going for a fisherman suplex. Fisherman buster. Oh, fisherman buster. Let's see. And now. She covers. Yep. One, two, only a two she count. Kick out. Brittany with great heart there. And now to the Let's top see, she's again. Going to the top rope. Could this be a moonsault from the fallen flower? Oh, Lord. This is going to be over. Oh, my goodness. She hit it. Cover. Two. And we have an interim champion. And that is who's in your future right now, Thunder Rosa. Wow. And your An winner. An impressive win. And the new interim Gold Rush Pro Wrestling Lady Luck Champion. Well, thank the you for joining us, Thunder Rosa. Oh, That's your future. It's going to be the Ballon Kikyo. I am not leaving yet. Well, she's going to bring out the best in you. We'll see. The Fallen Flower Kikio is now the holder of that championship. Like and I said before, I'm not scared of her. If people I love, if all my mind think that she's a bouncer or whatever, I don't. I honestly don't. I well, really don't. Thank you for joining me. You're going to have your shot. Get better soon. We I miss you. So. So it's Thunder Rosa's future. The interim champion is the Fallen Flower Kikyo.